Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are opening up the April Cat Lady box. And yay, because I'm opening it in actual April. It's amazing. I know. I know. I've already opened it because I'm a nugget. I did take videos of Eddie's first reactions to the videos, which I'll post at the end to the videos. His first reactions to the toys that came in here at the end. But anyway, we're going to get into it right now. Cat Lady Box is a $39.99 subscription every month. Um, you can get a discount if you buy like three boxes at one time or six boxes at one time. This week's artwork is right here. I think this one is super duper cute. Last last month I did not like very much, but this one is very up my alley. I love this. And it is by Rosanna Hansen. So that is that artwork right there. So the first thing in here that was quite exciting is I got my first cat lady t-shirt. Woohoo! And yes, I realize this is really large. They ask you for your t-shirt size when you sign up for the box. I asked for a large shirt because I like my t-shirts to be baggy. I normally only wear t-shirts when I'm sleeping or walking around the house. So that is a personal preference. This one has a v-neck, which is nice because I don't like super close necks. It says spring kitty potty and then no spay, no neuter, no service. And then also open catnip bar, unlimited treats. So that's very cute. Um, I'm excited about this. I think the colors are really nice and it's perfect for the warmer weather that is finally approaching. So woohoo! Next in here was this, which I think it's really cute, but do I see myself like wearing it all the time? Probably not because it's this hot pink rain poncho coat. And it's in the size large, extra large, so I think they just go off of your t-shirt size. But it's got a hood, so I guess that's good. And it's just, it's just a poncho. <coughs> it does have pockets. It does have pockets. So yeah, it's very loud and it's special. All right, so we're up to our first cat toy and it's super cute it's just a little yellow bunny ball it doesn't have a face which is probably good because it's kind of terrifying to watch the small little furry animal that you love so much try and kill things and drown them in its water bowl which is what eddie really likes to do also he's eating right now which is why he's not a part of this i'm sure he will come over eventually and start to bother me because he doesn't like me talking to cameras instead of him but this is the first toy. It's very, very cute. Eddie loves squishy, bolly type toys, so I think he will really enjoy this one. The next cat toy that we got in here is by Cat Lady, and it's just one of those daisy toys that's electronic and a little butterfly spins around. And when I tried this, I thought Eddie would really like it, but he was more interested in the motor sound that happens. It's like that, and it just it just flies around, but it makes that noise. And Eddie actually was more interested in the noise that was happening in the base of the toy. And so he was trying to like lift it up and try and get inside of here instead of what he's supposed to be doing, which is playing with this butterfly because my cat is a nugget. So anyway, he still really likes this toy. So I guess that's good. Um, I was actually gonna buy Eddie one of these, but now I already have one, so great. There's a card in here that says, next month's box celebrates you. It's your annual Cat Mom's Day box. So I'm gonna be real excited about that. And on the back, it's got a cute little kitty cat. Not as cute as Eddie, but I may be just slightly biased, but also Eddie's so cute. He came! Remember when I said he was eating and he doesn't like it when I talk on camera, so he comes to me. Can you not touch my face? I have makeup on. Baby, do you love your mommy? Look at him. Oh, Sorry. <laughs> so cute. Oh, puppy, baby, so cute. What's your brother? Okay, go. Where do you want to go? Come on. Anyway, you can leave. <laughs> the last thing in the box are ceramic toothbrush holder. The set includes two cat-shaped ceramic toothbrush holders and one ceramic tray. <laughs> 
My roommate just brought me a toothbrush. If you open it up, it is nicely packaged in bubble wrap. This is supposed to be the toothbrush holder. I don't know how that's supposed to work because it's really short. And then you also get this tray. But like, I don't know how this is supposed to hold the toothbrush. Let's try. So it's, it's like this. And then just like that. I feel like that's precarious though. I feel like that could just, just you blow on it and your toothbrush is on the floor and the cat's eating it. Like, I don't think this is, this is, no. Anyway, that is everything we got in this month's Cat Lady Box. And now I'm gonna find that card. I think Eddie's eating it. And I will tell you guys the prices of everything. So I got the card. The Kitty Potty shirt was $22.99 retail value. So $23. That's really expensive for a t-shirt. It's just a generic, like, regular cotton t-shirt. So I would not pay that much for it. The cat toothbrush holder set was $16.99, so $17. That's pretty reasonable, I think, but at the same time, I'm kind of like, yeah, I don't know about that. The raining cat's raincoat is $15 value, $14.99. Once again, not something I'll probably use. It's really cute. I might use it once or twice, but I already have like a nice, like proper raincoat instead of that flimsy thing. The flying butterfly toy was $5.99 or $6. That's a really good price. I have been researching those toys to like see which one I wanted to buy and they do range around six to seven dollars. Bunny ball catnip toy, which is the last item that we got in our box, is $4.99 value or $5, which is also very reasonable, um, but also very not reasonable because I would probably spend more like two or three dollars on that. So yeah, and that is our box. That brings the total value of our box to $66, which is pretty good for Cat Lady Box because as I've said in the past, Cat Lady Box is one of those boxes that you're not really buying it so that you can get like your money's worth out of the box. You're just kind of buying it to like get some like fun novelty type items um that are cat related and so i keep it around because it's fun to open every month but i'm not expecting it to be something like boxy charm where you pay 21 dollars and then get like 150 dollars value that's not the type of box this is so that's all i have for you guys today thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys next week hopefully i won't be so congested and allergic to everything maybe the pollen count will please please go down We'll see, <laughs> but until then, let's hope I survive until next week. Bye. <laughs> so the more they play with it, the less it goes around in circles, it'll like stay.